The plight of the African child has been a key concern globally as children are robbed of their childhood because of war, poverty, hunger, disease and abuse. In Uganda, many orphaned children head households. Around the continent, many others live on the streets, are used in armed conflicts and are sexually abused. To elevate the rights of African children, Ampkan Africa is seeking to address specific child rights violations. And at the forefront of this effort is renowned social activist Mariam Babangida, wife of former Nigerian president Ibrahim Babangida. I would tell you that I do not fear challenges. Yes. I accept this new challenge as another responsibility. Babangida, a one-time recipient of the Africa Prize for Leadership, has continued her social activism even after leaving office as First Lady. She is remembered in Nigeria, not just for her radiance and glamour, but as a woman who turned her position of First Lady into a potent force for women's rural development in Nigeria. We have women that are not educated. We have to empower them. We have to increase their economic ventures so as to be able to look after the kids. She is the founder of the Better Life Program for African Women, which works to empower African women. She's also credited for translating the Millennium Development Goals into major Nigerian languages. And it was through her machination when the husband was in power that the Commission for Women was established, which was later eventually under Abacha regime was upgraded to Ministry of Women Affairs. Child activists believe that her influence and cheerful flair will achieve much for African children. That she helps us to undertake advocacy visits so that these other African countries... Mrs. Babangida creates a new public sphere for First Ladies. As patron for Ampkan, she finds a common purpose with African children. The will to live, for she too has won a personal battle with cancer. Agnes Asimwe, NTV, Kampala.